Hey guys, what's up? Uh, it's me again, Jungmaster 3 and today it's time for the uh, tag, the uh, coffee film tag and I was tagged by Lola Spaceman so uh, I'll try to do this list as good as possible um, I mean, most of the titles that I picked out was very many horror stuff because I, those were the first that came to mind when I just uh, looked at the uh, question or the s whatever you want to call it so uh, yeah, let's begin right away. Now I don't have these, what they're called in my head, but so I'm just gonna have to um, watch Ricky's video just here so I can uh, make sure that I say everything right. So, uh, yeah, now I'm just going through here. Um, yeah, the first one was. Uh, Black Coffee, a movie you love but it's not easy to get into. And I got to go with Tetsuo, the Iron Man. This is basically the weirdest movie that I've ever seen. You don't really understand anything about it, but that's the reason why I love it. So, uh, yeah, Tetsuo, the Iron Man. And uh, the next one was, um, let's see here, Peppermint, a favorite Christmas movie. Now this ain't a Christmas Christmas movie for all ages because this is a Christmas horror related uh, movie and the movie is Santa Sleigh. So god I'm funny and I watch it every Christmas so yeah Santa Sleigh. And the next one was what was it called? Was it uh, Hot Chocolate, a favorite children's movie. I went with a Disney movie which I grew up with. I mean I could have taken The Lion King but I just would felt to be too obvious. So uh, I went with uh, a goofy movie. Grew up with this movie so uh, yeah I'm really a big fan of it and it's funny at times and so on so yeah a goofy movie. Um, and then the next one was uh, let's see here uh, Double Espresso. Uh, a movie that that held you on the edge of your seat uh, the whole movie through and I had to go with the French movie Inside it was so entertaining and it was never boring and it always, uh, almost every time, I mean it happened things all the time um, crazy and yeah really good, never boring and really entertaining Inside and then it was, um, let's see here, sorry for this but I just have to do it like this because otherwise I will just forget it. Um, Starbucks, a movie you've watched more more than any other movie. And for those of you who have, who have been like subscribing to my channel for a long time, already know this I guess, the movie is Young Guns. I mean, when I was in like 8th grade or ninth grade, I seriously went up earlier just to watch this movie before I went to school. Yeah, I was obsessed with this movie, so yeah, Young Guns. Or Obsessed was, I am still obsessed with that movie because that's a movie I can watch all the time. Um, and then it was Hipster Coffee Shop. Indie or or for in film shout out. Now, I can like misunderstood this question, but I uh, went with the uh, foreign film shout out uh, because I didn't really know what indie to pick out so I just went with foreign film shout out and uh, the movie is uh, Frontiers which I watched recently this was such a surprise I loved it and uh, was brutal and uh, grotesque and awesome yeah Frontiers and the next one was uh, yeah sorry once again sorry for this uh, oops got decaf a movie that disappointed you and I had to go with Soul Man over here um, was expecting a really funny nice 80s teen movie but it just left me disappointed I couldn't get into it for some reason I just felt it was boring and yeah, I don't really know why, but it just felt boring, so yeah, Soul Man. And uh, 
then we have, uh, let's see here, perfect blend, a bittersweet mix that seems perfect. Now this is another one I might have misunderstood, but I went with ginger snaps, I mean it has, it has these horror elements, and it's sort of a, it's a teen movie, and it is sort of a drama as well, and it has some comedic parts in it as well, and I think everything works out very nice. So yeah, ginger snaps. Now I have to speed up, or yeah, whatever. Let's see here. Uh, Coffee with your sugar, a movie you might love a little too, a little too much. Sleepaway Camp. Um, I think that was everything. No, I think there's one left. There's um, the one. Uh, friends don't let friends have Starbucks. A movie you tell others to avoid. And that's a movie which I don't even have in my own collection. So I had to go with Paranormal Activity. Piece of shit in my opinion. But yeah. Thank you very much for watching. And before I end this video I want to tag... Um, Three people, Tim Walker, TJ Pyramid, and uh, The Cryptic Cinema to make this uh, video or responsive if you want to. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed and didn't get bored, and I hope to see you again as soon as possible. So, see you next time. Bye bye.